WBAL TV 11 editorial board. Here is President and General Manager Dan Jarrett. The video is still stunning to watch some four years later. Back in April of 2014, a portion of 26th Street between Charles and St. Paul Streets in Baltimore City collapsed after days of heavy rains, sending cars plummeting into the adjacent CSX train tracks below. Fast forward to this week when city crews responded to another stretch of 26th Street between Calvert Street and Guilford Avenue after residents noticed a buckled sidewalk. That's just two blocks from where 26th Street collapsed four years ago. Fearing a repeat of 2014, city officials rushed in a structural engineer who assessed the situation and discovered a crack in the retaining wall that holds the street above the train tracks. Inspectors continue to monitor the situation as repairs are made. Major catastrophe averted. But imagine living in that community and facing this issue yet again. But instead of addressing the problem in a complete and thorough fashion the first time, they addressed what they had to, the part that collapsed, but left this block um, untouched. But considering the potential dangers, including property damage and even possible loss of life, why didn't the city and CSX take steps to put the matter to rest altogether? At this point, would it not be in everyone's best interest for inspectors to assess the areas alongside the entire CSX railway? Don't our residents deserve better? WBAL-TV welcomes responsible replies to this editorial.